Okay guys, I've, I've seen a video <clears throat> on YouTube showing you how to do this on your Alice pack. So, make a clip for it. I thought it was pretty cool. So, I'm trying to do this one-handed. Okay. Anyway, show you how to do this. What I did was I found clips. <clears throat> Excuse me, sinuses. Found clips on on a three-day pack the strap things that go over top of it and pain in the butt to zip zip this up so I trimmed that off I really don't use it I don't have a use for it I guess it's for like a sleeping pad or something but whatever I really don't use it so anyway I cut that off and I put them put this down here so I can still use this if I choose to. I didn't have to sew anything. So what I did was, where'd it go? Oh, I lost it. <laughs> there it is. <clears throat> okay, I just cut this. Sorry, dog hair all over the place. Cut this and then um, this longer strap will be over here. So you just take this and then you just put this the folded over end right there over it, so it'll hold itself really really strong. Can you hold that right there? Okay. And then my daughter's help helping me. And just loop it through. Oh. Like that. Whatever length you want. So you can put as much strain as you want on it. And Take Daddy, this. You hold hold on. Now you hold it. And then loop this through. I think I'm doing this right. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe not. Let me take this off. It's easier. Yeah, this way. You want the bottom loop to go through, so you, you're facing with the little rib thing right there on the very bottom, bottom hole, and then pull it through, and then pull this up through. Then you can. Pull it tight. Then if you want to get in it, boom, you're done. So, I like my little Alice Pack modification. Not sure if you will or not, give it a try. It's worth it in my, my opinion. 